Qing Si Huang made one of the largest sculptures in the world. I use the word Sao is because that's where Qing Si Huang was born, and the descendant of Qing Si Huang actually carries the surname of Sao. This is the first homecoming show for Xiao Cao, and uh, this is also the first time that I'm bringing the showcase of the terracotta back to Malaysia. When I first met Michelle, I was very inspired by what she's doing. Michelle gives us a very new dimension to the show that Malaysians have not seen before, and I'm very happy to be able to work on this uh, collaboration of the sculptures and artwork in our coming exhibition. Our vision as Qingari is to always inspire, so we want to share as much of the art to the community here. We are showcasing 11 artworks and 11 sculptures. It's about Xiao Zhao coming back to life during the 70s. I believe that this series is very in line with Louis XIII the deep heritage that they have, similar to Xiao Zhao, who has a very deep history and cultural values. We are also introducing three NFTs by Michelle Yap. This NFT will encapsulate the entire art into the NFT. I really appreciate the Louis XIII Connect, and I believe that generations and generations of silent masters are also like an artist, creating the most purest form of art. Continue to express our unique relation to time by paying tribute to Mother Earth. We are proud to launch Believe in Time. Louis XIII is a life achievement of generations of cellar masters. At Louis XIII, time is the raw materials that shapes who we are.